today is today's a great day. It's, uh, it's, it's uh, a time when we realize uh, the benefits of, of a lot of our hard work, a lot of the hard work of, of our partners, the Dowling Company, uh, which we've been very, very happy with. Uh, we're going to make a lot of families happy today. I think the impact we're having on the affordable housing market in Maui County overall, just not for Hawaiians, but, but for, the, for the open community, is, is, it's a good thing and it's a great day. Public-private partnerships play a critical role in our success at Hawaiian Homes. Identifying good partners in the private community that can work with government to, to provide the benefits we're, we're giving today. And, and Dowling is an example, Dowling Company is an example of that for us. This is a chicken skin experience for us. Anytime you get this many people in a room and uh, they get their first home, it, you can't communicate the excitement. It's just, it's, um, it's terrific. Native Hawaiians have the lowest percentage of home ownership of any segment of our population. And if, if we can be part of that solution and support the efforts of the Department of Hawaiian Homelands to put Native Hawaiians into housing, it's a privilege. It, it takes a strong collaboration, people with a very, very committed will to make so many units happen so quickly. We thank you for your patience. We um, assure you that we will do our very best to build you a quality home. We're going to incorporate as many uh, green features and sustainable features into your home as we can the, um, and to make it as healthy of a living environment for you and your family as possible. So thank you for, um, for being here today. We're, we're very, very proud to be able to support you and we congratulate you on uh, taking this step to home ownership. Thank you. Thank you.
that gets their homestead, that has a home, that's one less family competing in the general population for affordable housing. So it helps all of us, not just the Hawaiian people. Wendy's attracted developers to build the subdivisions, like Everett Dowling, who's here today, who's been involved now in many of these subdivisions. He didn't just get a developer. He has a way of transmitting to someone who didn't have this kind of connection to the Hawaiian community. He transmitted to them the love of the Hawaiian people and a higher calling than just making money. But Everett Dowling's calling now is to be a partner in bringing about the dreams that we all have, and we appreciate what he's done very much. Thank you, Everett. And the thing is, what I look at is I look at the elderly people too, you know. I've seen a lot of elderly people, they, they you know, you, you, you want them to be in there, you know, ahead of you too because, you know, you see them getting old and, you know, things like that. But we're very blessed, that's, that's what I know, yeah. <laughs> To bring in private partners to do a development is one thing, but the developers who come in here, and in this case it's Everett Dowling has come in, they develop a heart for the Hawaiian people and for the, for the Department of Hawaiian Homelands, and that makes them a much better partner. So while they're used to building subdivisions, they're really not used to this kind of uh, gratitude from people. And I think it's made them view all these projects in a much different way. And, and we're just glad to have them as partners. I've been waiting 20 years, and it means everything to me. At least now, I, can ha I have a house to um, house my kids. And when they grow up, maybe it will pass down to generations. The, I like the location where it's going to be. It's close to the ocean. It's close to um, a golf course where I can go and um, get some relax, do my um, release some some relieve some stress, and hit some balls, some golf balls. Uh -huh. How about you, Han? Well, I, actually, I'm just glad that we have we finally have a chance to have a home of our own. And I know that a lot of the Hawaiians have been waiting for a long, long time, and it's finally a dream. Finally, a dream that's happening now. It's a dream come true. Yes. A dream come true. I was really excited because my, my dad waited for Hawaiian homes, eh? but he passed away, so I ended up taking over for, for his successorship on this. Yeah, we never thought we'd have our own home, but through this program, we finally got it. We waited a long time, but we're, 
for the week. I'm a happy mom because I took care of my children and made them apply into Hawaiian homeland. And we've been here since 1974 of, at Maui, at Papakalo, and then from there, my children grew up and they became to have their own love. And this is my son, Rodney. He has awarded a lot in uh, Waiau Ko for, and I'm a proud mom because this is my last son that have a Hawaiian home then. And I thank Hawaiian home and I thank God for awarding all of my children their home.